Alright, what is up you guys? And as always, welcome back to another OU battle, which is truly the Skyrender. And today we're going up against Dahara. And, um, you know, we've been doing good with this team. I had so far no wins. And I never expected that one, but we have come close a few times. And um, this is actually, like, the testing process was over. I had a really tough game last day versus... Uh, my opponent, uh, Bigger Obehara, which just really knocked it out of the park. Now my opponent here, this is great. This is something that just looks about right. Tahara brings all the stops and, uh, I mean, it's a cup food here. I like cup food. This is super creative and uh, a Lola Ninetales looks really scary. Whimsy Cock can always be annoying. And this is a game where Barbecue looks to be usable and also Malolic might actually alone beat me flawlessly. <laughs> but Unburden Lipar looks good. Um, I don't see a spinner on the team. I do see, however, a defogger. But for me, the easy lead is Ninetales because of... Uh, well, because of the obvious, because of Aurora Veils. I feel, I feel like you lead off with Fifron with little to no issue. Uh, and if by chance my opponent leads up with something like Bolt Sound, I'm gonna send in Rygard my Mudstale and uh, hope for the best. And I have no idea what Cup Food does. Like, the horror looked to be super. Like, you get the feeling already when you talk to, about some, with somebody that they're trying to be somewhat creative. And, and, you know, I'm clearly famous for not necessarily going all out. And I appreciate when my. Opposing team are doing just that. Uh, now, Melodic Lead could be scary because while I will Volt Switch, I also know that <laughs> they are carrying Mirror Code if I'm unlucky. Um, it would be. Hey! Okay. Okay, okay. So we're allowing Dynamaxing. I feel like that should be. In should be in a dialogue always. Do well out Dynamax. I always say smoke and rules, and I kind of hope. What if? What if that concept, com <laughs> concept hits in? Alright, so we did it right. I have no idea what we're switching into. And I mean, how would I? Uh, I mean, so far it's my best switching. And I know ice is happening. Uh, oh, this is awful. And I can't... I can't stall this out. Ah! Uh, yeah, so far it's my best switch, and I really hope she goes for a, a max... Um, max water thingy. Max guy should... <laughs> water thingy! And how much will that do? Plenty. Plenty. And now it's raining. So, max rainfall is going to be the following move. So, or I mean the ice move. So, Barbara Q is going to be more important than you would ever know. Switch it out, actually. Cool. So, so waste that Dynamax that early. Super aggressive. Super aggressive. Brings in Bolt Hound, and all of a sudden, I could be screwed. Um, however, I have a combination here that I want to try out. While Fire Lash is not the best move in there, I do decrease that defense. Oh, okay. Okay. Brains the back Melodic. Don't be competitive. That's going to make me look weird. I don't want to watch this. Okay. Do I need it? Yes. Yes, I do. So... <laughs> Jesus. I guess we're bringing it back so far. Um, I mean, if she has Skull, which they do, then the risk of burning me is just... 
this just went from worse to even worse. It's a, a trappy melodic. Ah, we'll power whip anyway. That melodic is going to be the end of me. Brings back Bolt Town. This time, of course, I can't switch out, so she got that one right. Connect the power wave, we're just gonna do a huge chunk. <laughs> I 132 32 attack, max attack adamant is not that easy to switch into. Okay, bring some cup food. That has to be worried. I don't believe Cup Fu can do like a stream a lot of damage, but at the same time, I don't feel I want to take that risk. By the way, is that shiny or I've never seen Cup Fu. By the way, I do realize that Mr. Surge is so counterproductive with Toxic Spikes and the Strange Steam. Air lace. That's cool. Do I switch in something else here to try to abuse this? Because I want to get. <sighs> right, yeah, switch out precisely. That's what you do. To copper. Oh no. To Copperage, that's um, that's the stop for me. What do we mean, Copperage? What any sane person would do is send Rygard. Now, Mud Steel is actually quite nice. This generation, it's never been this good, but uh, I think I'm using the wrong set of what is to be considered good. It still does a lot. Resisted my ass. So I can be the only one feeling that one Malode coming right up. So I'll, I'll try to get this one right. There is no way she went for Power Whip. I'm getting worried. Yes. Malotic, Malotic, Malotic. Yes! Yes! It's time to plot. This could have haste, however, so it's not... It's not perfect. But it sure as hell is looking really good now. Because live part is no joke. Here we go, there's Whirlpool. That's no problem. That hurts. Hurt badly. That hurts way more than I would. I'm, you know, I got a plus one defense here. That's wow. Okay. Okay. Did not expect that damage. Um, we draw the melodic to Copperage. I should nasty plot it one more time. This top is gonna sting though. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. All right, we're in this. We're in this. Let's do this. Come on. Mm. <laughs> By the way, the reason I sit like this is because I have the mic down here. But uh, <laughs> all right, snow warning. We are faster, and we have burning jelly sea. I don't know. I don't know. Here we go. <laughs> Come on, I <line> fought. <gasps> Fuck. <laughs> Do we take this? Ooh, no, of course not. Are you, are you mad? Okay. Okay. Um. Now I have nothing faster here to stop that Aurora Veil. Ah, it's not good. That's not good at all. 
the fire lash here. Can't do anything about it. Okay. Okay. Ghost Melodic. With this minus defense, I'm pretty sure. I am pretty sure that knockoff could kill, but we are slower. We also this is a fully offensive Malorek. Because its whirlpool does way too much. I sucker punch here. I'll take that risk. Yes! Yes! It worked! It finally worked! <laughs> it finally worked! She knew a skull would kill me and would be far the better option. <laughs> yes! It's working! Like, if I only get one kill with Heatra, like, that's it! Like, for me, it's such a horrible Pokémon to use. Don't ask Pokémon about that, because he insists on it. This is the best, the best Volcarona um, check in the game. But I don't know. I just don't know. Now versus this, I'm, I could Fire Lash, I could... Let's see, what do we got left? We got Kapfu, we got a Dead Nine Tails. We are in the wrap-up anyway. Actually, let's try to get the most out of this. Right, it is time. It is time to show what Heatmore is all about. And it might not be a lot, but we're gonna do it anyway. Because as of right now, you are in the barbecue territory. And Heatmore has never looked more glorious. And it might be faster. Yeah, it actually feels faster. Hey! How about that? Oh. Guess we don't joke it around with Adamant here. No way violent on that poor guy. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Do we have a Heatmore sweep going? I would say so. I have two more turn of Dynamax and I don't see any of the remaining Pokemon pulling the way to stop me. Here comes Ninetales trying to steal my thunder. I kind of regret that I didn't go for Stealth Rocks. A little bit. Right, let's do this. Let's do this. What can you do? Honestly, what could you do? Okay, fine. Did not want to give me the pleasure. Zahara. I thought we were... I thought we were one. The second you Dynamax first turn. Alright. Um, Zahara, GG for the game. Really appreciated it. Who knew we could score a win with this team. All we needed was a person of a similar mind when it comes to team building and trying to have a bit more inventive teams. Um, and for everyone watching. Thank you for doing just so. You guys are awesome. And as always, have a great day, everyone. Take care. Bye.